Now, it's a vital link to a beauty spot in the heart of the jewel of Murray. But now, the community of Lossy Mouth fears a 100-year-old bridge leading to a popular beach could face closure unless urgent repairs are done. They're launching a crowdfunding campaign to secure the future of the East Beach Bridge, as Nicola McCallie reports. Lossy Mouth's East Beach is a popular spot, with thousands of people flocking to enjoy its sparkling sea and sands all year round but soon people could be left high and dry unless the bridge, which makes it accessible, undergoes vital repairs. This is really sharp, sharp steel there, so mm -hmm. it's, it's just becoming a, a very big hazard to, to the public. As you can imagine, steel by the seaside doesn't, uh, doesn't bode very well and um, it, over the years it's, it's just coming to, to the point of needing either severe uh, maintenance or a replacement bridge. We are looking to raise funds for a full survey to assess the structure, the wooden piers of the bridge, to see if we can just replace the top of the bridge, because a whole new bridge would be extremely costly. The bridge has been in place for more than 100 years, but the passage of time has not been kind, with rust, wear and tear all taking their toll. In a further complication, it's unclear who the bridge belongs to. Now the Lossy Mouth Community Trust is launching a crowdfunding campaign to try to secure its future. The bridge is actually owned by nobody. The Development Trust has gone to a lot of bother to find that out, so nobody actually owns it. The community in Lossiemouth needs to still get access to the bridge for themselves and for the people of Murray and beyond. And so somebody has to take it on, and we've decided that we're going to do that. Murray Council has said it will support the campaign insofar as offering expertise in seeking funding for the project. It's not just important to Lossiemouth, it's important to the whole of Murray. Uh, this links the one of our coastal routes all the way from Garmouth to Lossiemouth and it's a very important stretch of, uh, of beach. In the short space of time that we've been here, more than 50 people plus dogs and surfboards have crossed this bridge. It's certainly very well used and the Community Trust want to keep it that way to ensure there is a crossing here to the beach for future generations. Nicola McCallie, STV News.